Google DeepMind's new Genie AI turns static images into interactive worlds. Plus, these virtual environments include video game characters that can navigate autonomously as well as exhibit many other dynamic behaviors. And the implications of Genie extend far beyond just gaming, promising to redefine the landscape of robotics, virtual reality, and more. But first, the inception of Genie was driven by Google's idea to harness its vast expanse of internet videos not just for generating static images or sequences but for creating immersive, interactive experiences. This AI marvel transforms assorted image prompts into dynamic virtual worlds, enabling game characters to move and interact within these spaces in a logically consistent manner. And while the initial allure of Genie lies in its application for video games, its researchers at Google DeepMind also see a critical use case for Genie to develop sophisticated models to power intelligent robots. Impressively, Genie is an 11 billion parameter model that was designed as a foundation model for 2D platformers meaning it can take an unfamiliar visual input, along with a human-specified action, and conjure up a virtual world where this action unfolds. Then, the AI determines which elements within an image are likely to perform actions and animates them accordingly, even accounting for complex effects like parallax, where foreground and background elements move at different speeds to create depth. Another distinct feature of Genie is its learning process, which relies solely on videos, eschewing traditional inputs like gamepad commands. And the model was trained on a curated dataset of 30,000 hours from an initial trove of 200,000 hours of gaming videos available online, specifically focusing on 2D platform games. This training involved a trio of components, a video tokenizer, action model, and a dynamics model, collectively enabling Genie to predict actions and subsequent frames in a video with remarkable accuracy. And on top of transforming the gaming world, Genie's potential goes far beyond. For example, a smaller version of Genie that was equipped with just 2.5 billion parameters also demonstrated its prowess by navigating videos of robotic arms as it showcased its ability to envision coherent environments and replicate intricate motion sequences. This experiment proves Genie's versatility as having potential to serve as a foundational tool for robotics capable of generating realistic simulations for training robotic agents. Despite its groundbreaking achievements though, the DeepMind team is still treading carefully. This is because Genie, like any pioneering technology, has its limitations. Currently being able to remember just 16 frames at a time and operating at a speed of one frame per second. Moreover, in a move echoing OpenAI's cautious approach, DeepMind has also decided against releasing Genie's model code or weights to the public. And by generating these kinds of interactive, coherent environments from mere images, Genie is laying the groundwork for hyper-realistic and complex simulations that can dynamically respond. As these kinds of models evolve, they're poised to advance robotic systems into the next paradigm. But there's a robot that's already raising eyebrows with its most recent feat, as Sanctuary AI's Phoenix robot can now autonomously perform tasks at the speed of a human. In fact, Sanctuary's ambition is to infuse human-like intelligence into general-purpose robots, with Phoenix being a means to that end. This sixth-generation robot acts as a general-purpose system capable of adapting to a wide array of human tasks, with the Carbon AI control system being responsible for the robot's memory, sight, sound, and touch. Phoenix is designed to take on almost any job with unparalleled versatility in both physical and virtual realms, thanks to its Sanctuary World engine. Importantly though, Phoenix is not intended to supplant the human workforce, but to augment and enhance it, making workplaces safer and more efficient through any of several methods, including direct piloting, pilot assist, or autonomous operation under human supervision. This robot can seamlessly work alongside its human counterparts, ensuring safety and efficiency all the while. But what truly sets Phoenix apart is Sanctuary's carbon control system, a hybrid of symbolic and neural reasoning. This dual approach allows the AI to exhibit a level of reasoning and learning that has never been seen before, bridging the gap between human and machine intelligence. Sanctuary's innovation lies in its ability to mitigate the weaknesses commonly associated with AI, presenting a system that is both intelligent and adaptable. The Robots Doing Stuff series showcases the capability of Phoenix as the future of labor. With human-like hands capable of fine dexterity, full-body mobility, 
and a max payload of 25 kilograms, Phoenix operates at a max speed of 5 kilometers per hour with a stature that stands at 170 centimeters tall and weighs 70 kilograms, being designed to fit seamlessly into human environments. Meanwhile, another breakthrough method has been revealed to allow soft robot fingers to discern the characteristics of objects they touch, such as ripeness or firmness, without the need for embedded sensors, which could transform the accuracy and capabilities of robots, making them more intuitive and adaptable than ever before. The conventional approach to soft robotics involved integrating sensors within the robot's fingers to provide feedback on the objects they encountered. This recent innovation, however, utilizes an ingenious external measurement of air pressure changes as the robot's fingers grip and interact with various objects. This method's beauty lies in its simplicity and versatility, opening up a plethora of applications far beyond the initial focus on agricultural harvesting. Imagine a world where robots, equipped with this sensor-free technology, perform delicate surgeries, assist in intricate manufacturing processes, or even provide care in a personal setting. The ability to gauge and adapt to the environment without the need for complex, embedded sensors allows for a new level of precision and safety in tasks that require a gentle touch. While the technology was first demonstrated with the task of picking tomatoes, its potential extends into much more complex domains. In healthcare, for example, soft robotic tools can now perform minimally invasive procedures with an unprecedented level of sensitivity, reducing the risk of tissue damage and improving patient outcomes. This sensor-free approach could also revolutionize manufacturing, where the ability to accurately assess and manipulate delicate components can significantly enhance production quality and efficiency. One of the most significant advantages of this new method is its compatibility with existing soft robots, offering a retrofit solution that bypasses the challenges associated with integrating traditional sensors. This plug-and-play system not only simplifies the design and operation of soft robots, but also makes them more accessible for a wide range of applications, from food processing to sensitive archaeological excavations. As the technology evolves, the ambition is to extend these capabilities further, enabling robots to make even more nuanced decisions based on a broader range of detected properties, such as weight or texture. This leap in sensor-free technology not only expands the frontier of what robots can achieve, but also paves the way for more humane and intuitive interactions between machines and the natural world. The future is clearer than ever before, and it's looking like robots are becoming more like humans, and we're becoming more like robots. The only question remaining is whether or not there will come a point when we'll no longer be able to tell the difference between the two.